What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another video for the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs for 2021. I'm really excited about this because the first round was phenomenal and today we're going to be focusing on the second round and sharing my thoughts and predictions of who I think is going to advance and what the outcomes of each match is going to be. Now unlike previous years where the first round comes to a complete end before the second round starts, that was not the case this year. The second round has already started as I'm recording this video. Now so far it's already been amazing hockey so let's just get right into the second round up first we have the Boston Bruins versus New York Islanders both of these picks from the previous rounds I did guess correctly that they would advance and that makes me very excited because these two here I think it's gonna be very interesting but in my opinion it could at times be very one-sided of course Boston already has one win against the Islanders for this round so who knows what will happen moving forward Boston eliminated the Washington Capitals is something that I predicted just because I wanted to give Boston a little push and between Boston and Washington I thought Boston would advance now the underdog the Islanders versus the Pittsburgh Penguins I predicted the Islanders because they have been on fire this past season and previous seasons and I think they have a really good potential making it to the finals this year this one Boston versus Islanders both teams have amazing players in my opinion Favorite player on Boston right now is Taylor Hall. I think he's phenomenal. I don't know at the end of the year if he's going to stay there or not, but he is phenomenal and he is helping out the team. On the other hand, the Islanders, my favorite player is Pajot. And if you guys know me, I absolutely love Pajot. So for this one here, the prediction, I'm honestly say it's going to be going to the Islanders. And I think it's going to be 3-4, boiled down right to the last game, which I think is going to be very exciting. Of course, Boston already has one win, but I think this whole series is going to go to New York Islanders. And I think it's going to go down to the final game. The next series is the Colorado Avalanche versus the Vegas Golden Knights. Both of these picks were once again correct for my previous round, my previous video, and that was exciting to see. Now, with these two teams facing each other, I honestly feel once again it could go either way, but Vegas is somebody that, in my opinion, they have a lot of great players, but the Avalanche have been phenomenal. In the first game, it was 7-1. For this series so with the Colorado Avalanche just dominating the first game I think I know how it's going to go and I honestly am going to make a pretty easy and simple prediction for this one I think Colorado is going to win I think it's going to be either 4-0 clean sweep for the Avalanche which is something that they did in the previous round I think it was 4-0 against St. Louis I can't remember off the top of my head even though it just happens but I think either uh, Colorado is going to win 4-0 against Vegas and move to the third round or it's going to be something like 4-1. I don't think Vegas is going to win too many just because they got embarrassed in the first game. They just were demolished and I thought that was crazy. I was really looking forward to see Vegas advance and really go for it this year but I think the Colorado Avalanche are a team that definitely can do it. They have a lot of great players, and I can't wait to see what actually happens. But I'm rooting for Colorado Avalanche, so I think right now my prediction is going to be either 4-0 or 4-1 for the Colorado Avalanche. Hopefully a clean sweep. That'd be exciting to see, but we'll see what happens. Next up, we have Tampa Bay Lightning versus Carolina Hurricanes. Now, in the first round, I did predict that the Hurricanes were going to advance. Unfortunately, the Panthers did not beat Tampa Bay, and Tampa Bay did advance. Tampa Bay is a dominant team. They won the Cup last year. They've won the Cup in the past. They have a lot of key players and a lot of stars players and a lot of my favorite players are as part of their team however I really want to see what Carolina can do moving forward and I want to see what happens now Tampa Bay already has one win in this series unfortunately but I want to give it to Carolina Hurricanes I want to give them the benefit of the doubt that they can outlast and beat the Tampa Bay Lightning which I think would be phenomenal so my prediction even though Tampa Bay already has one win so far I'm going to say Carolina Hurricanes. I'm going to say it's going to be 4-2 for the Carolina Hurricanes. I think after losing the first game, there's a lot of players on that team that I absolutely love and ones that I think can improve and do better, and they better if they want to win. But I'm going to say 4-2 for the Carolina Hurricanes because I want to see the Tampa Bay Lightning get eliminated. I want to see another team win and take the cup this year instead of one that's always a dominant team. And the next series is the Montreal Canadiens 
versus the Winnipeg Jets. This one here was very exciting. In the first round, the Winnipeg Jets clean swept the Edmonton Oilers, which is not something I predicted. I wanted to see the Oilers advance. But once again, it seemed like they choked during the playoffs. Someone that's a team that was phenomenal in the regular season doesn't do so hot in the playoffs, which does suck. So in the future, I'm going to predict right now the Connor McDavid, he's going to be traded or he's going to sign with a new team once his contract expires. And I think that's something that I can realistically see happening just because the team itself is just not doing so hot. Make it to the playoffs and get eliminated very, very quick. It was a clean sweep 4-0 for Winnipeg Jets, which is not something I've seen. Now, on the other hand, Montreal Canadiens in the first rounds, in the early first rounds, they looked like they were going to be eliminated. Toronto was doing phenomenal. And then John Tavares did get injured and is still injured. And then the Montreal Canadiens ended up tying the series and then taking the series from Toronto, which is something I didn't expect. I did not predict. I do not like Montreal whatsoever. You guys know this. But they did win in the first round and beat out Toronto. Now, what is going to happen between the Montreal Canadiens and Winnipeg Jets? I think because the clean sweep that the Winnipeg Jets did against the Oilers, I think they're going to be very rough and they're going to be expecting a lot more. And they're going to be very, very on point with everything they do on the ice. But the Montreal Canadiens for tying the series right down to the last game and then winning and advancing to the second round, that is very impressive as well. And I think a lot of the players are very excited to make a very big impact in the playoffs this year. But... I'm going to just go based on my personal opinions that the fact that I just do not like the Montreal Canadiens, I'm going to have to predict Winnipeg Jets are going to win this series, and I'm going to say it's going to be 4-2 for the Winnipeg Jets. Now, do I see the Winnipeg Jets winning the Cup this year? Absolutely not. I just don't want to see Montreal advance and get any closer to the Cup than they already are. So these are my predictions as of right now for the second round of the NHL playoffs. Yes, the NHL playoffs second round has already started and there's three games already down. And today it's going to be very exciting with the NHL hockey of what else is going to happen. But I think the whole series itself is going to be very exciting, especially the Islanders and Boston Bruins. That one I honestly could see going either way. Same with the Colorado Avalanche and Vegas. I could see that going either way, even though the Colorado just dominated the first game. Who knows? It's the playoffs. Anything can happen. Comment down below what you guys think is going to happen and who is going to win and your predictions on the second round of the NHL playoffs and also who you think is going to take the cup this year. My prediction right now is going to be the Colorado Avalanche, but again, who knows what will happen. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.